Hi Virgo, I hope you're doing awesome. This is a quick little tarot card reading for you today. This is gonna go by kind of fast. Um, my son is in the room with me today, so if that bothers you, little people bother you, you might wanna just click off the video because this isn't for you. He might start talking. Um, you know how it is. You parents out there, you know how it is. All right, so Holy Spirit for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising. What can they expect? What is their current energy? What is their card for today? Let's see. We have ego right here. We have ego. They're playing that Beyonce song, He Has a Big Ego. Some of you might be dealing with a male that has um, a big ego, but for some of you, it's about your ego. Um, the illusion of being trapped, accepting responsibility for your situation, and then making choices that support your path to happiness, addictions, and unhealthy relation. Um, it says it didn't say relationships. It says habits right here. So this is about basically letting go of unhealthy things and killing your ego today. But for someone here, you're dealing with a male here that has like a really big ego. I'm also getting at the bottom of the deck here because I do want to look at the bottom of the deck right now. We have the Three of Swords. This is actually the Three of Swords. It doesn't look like it, but it is. Um, it's in reverse right here. I really feel like, Virgo, you are actually breaking free. Um, this is kind of giving me my clarification on what's going on here. I feel like you're breaking the change with something. Like your ego was in the way and you're starting to break the chains. And by doing that, it's reversing your heartbreak. What is Virgo's obstacle today? We have, is that our, okay. This is the King of Swords, but it's in reverse right here. I do not like the King of, sorry. I do not like the King of Swords in reverse right here. You guys might be dealing with, they're saying he's a cold hearted snake. You guys might be dealing with someone who is inconsiderate today. I'm not going to lie. Um, the King of Swords is an a-hole. I'm just going to say it. He is. He's a complete a-hole. He abuses his power. Some of you may be dealing with someone like that. Um, this person may even make you feel weak, I'm getting right now. As I'm like kind of cutting the, the deck. This person might, um, you know, it's really interesting. This isn't going to resonate with everybody with the strength in reverse right here. I feel like this person is not in good health. Um, this person may not be in good health. You might be hearing about that. Like they're not in good health. Something about their, their health. Their health in a young female. Very weird. I don't know what this is about, but this is definitely speaking to somebody. Um, this could be you, Virgo. Um, this could even be you. But that's that's weird. Okay, something about someone's health here I'm dealing with them. That might be a bit of an, um, an obstacle. But overall, what I'm getting with cancer, uh, some of you might be even dealing with a cancer too. This person may be a cancer, even though it's the king of swords. This person may have like a cancer placement. I'm getting cancer in their chart. Let me get another card. Clarification on this. We have the, okay, the ending of challenging times too. We're getting in, an ending of challenging times. I feel like this person may actually, like I said, have some health problems that you may be hearing about. Um... They may even want to make amends with you. Um, for some of you, this person may even want to make amends with you. I'm getting. And for some of you, this has, for some of you, I'm getting, this has something to do with a little boy. Um, I feel like this person has recently, has like abused their power in some way. Um, they abuse their power and there could be like a child involved for some of you, not all of you. But something about a child being involved. All right. What is the advice for Virgo today? Oh, 
We have the Two of Pentacles here. This is the Two of Pentacles. And I'm really drawn to the two clocks here. Um, this is strange. Something about balancing your time is very is an obstacle for you. Something about balancing your time. That is going to be... They're telling you to balance your time. Balance. Bring balance. Find balance because you're juggling things. I'm also getting something about... <laughs> for the, this is your advice. Um, something about a different type of pants. Someone here is trying to wear like some pants. That, see the way this, these pants look kind of like um, just different. They have all those colors. Something about buying some pants. Someone here buy, getting advice about some pants. You might even get some advice about some pants or something like that that are like very different. Like they stand out. They're very colorful. Um, they could not be colorful, but something about these pants are very like different or something like that. But Spirit is telling you to remain staying in balance. Remain staying in balance because you are doing a really good job. You are killing your ego right here. Um, you are definitely accepting responsibility for your options. But then I feel like there's this weird energy with this um, weird um, King of Swords type person. Um, Spirit is saying um, if you encounter this person, you make sure you stand your ground. You stand your ground. Okay. Let's see what else is happening for Virgo today. What else is happening for Virgo today? This could be even, even somebody who just says like a rude comment or something like that. We have book burning. So we have the book burning for today. I feel like you're really burning your past today. Like, that's really significant. You were burning your past, um, especially when it comes to someone that may have been playing mind games or maybe you feel like your mind was playing tricks on you. Something about burning, burning that. And also, I'm getting silencing. Something about silencing something. Um, you're also changing the narrative to your life. Beautiful. What else for Virgo today? Yeah, Lord. We have forces working against you. And we have discord, discord among friends and family here. It's interesting, Virgo. You may actually be hearing also about like this person that's a, like abuses their power. This could be like a friend telling you about their ex abusing their power that they have kids with. Or it could be a friend telling you about... Um, Something that uh, their ex or something like that is doing to them, like a, a male is doing to them. It could be a female because it doesn't have to have like, um, it doesn't have to be male. But someone, you may be hearing about that. It doesn't have to be something that's directly, um, well, directly directed towards you. You could be actually be hearing about it because we do have the mice right here. Discord among friends and family. Someone is abusing their power. That you'll be hearing about. We also have stepping into a new experience. Something about somebody working on their legs. That's also um, significant for some Virgo here. Something about your legs. Um, but I do have you stepping into a new experience. We do have the Discord today. I'm not going to lie. You're going to be hearing about some type of um, dysfunction um, discord in the family or around your friends. And like I said, I really think it has something to do with this king of swords type person. You may also be feeling like forces are working against you, but they're not. I kind of, because <laughs> I feel like you guys, spirit says something about the grand finale. You guys are like, there's a grand finale. Something's completely closing here for you guys. Um, you guys might be feeling like forces are working against you. Like things are like falling on the ground. Um, you know, stupid stuff, maybe, I don't know, just like your phone's acting dumb. Just silly stuff may be happening during the day, but just completely ignore it and keep it moving. It's just dumb stuff, like little stuff might break. That's what this force is working against you card typically means for me. It could literally mean um, you're doing something with an axe. I doubt, I don't know when the hell has an axe. Um, <laughs> I don't know who watches my video. I don't know very many people who have an axe. Um, 
but there could be something to do with a a axe as well and there could be actually be something to do with mice today you might find a my a mouse a mouse video something to do with mice as well because that's how my gift works too it could literally be what's on the picture okay all right what is your affirmation for today what is virgo's affirmation i want to keep it short we're just going to do an affirmation and we're going to close the reading virgo's affirmation thank you it is i am grateful for my day and everything i learned and experienced beautiful it says i am grateful for my day and everything i learned and experienced i love that all right virgo you go out there and have an amazing day love you all bye